Hi everyone, Sully here from Black Ops Toys coming at you today with an unboxing of the new Easy and Simple French Commando. And these are awesome. So lots of really nice gear. It's nice to see like, like the, the soldiers from different countries, but there's two versions of this. This happens to be the S version. There is also an R version, which is more civilian uh, style. So very, very, very cool figure. Super excited, lots of cool stuff in here. All right, so two trays. Top and bottom. Let's go ahead and pop these out. Let's do the uh, figure first. So fantastic head sculpt. I'm telling you, if you know the actor uh, who that's based on, leave that in the comments below. A lot of times companies will see a famous actor in a movie and then they'll make the head sculpts based on the actors that are popular. But nice head sculpt. The ENS sculpts are getting better and better and better. So you do have the really nice French camouflage and this is a brand new uniform cut. You can see it's got the built-in, you know, different fabric color knee pads. There is an insert inside here, so you can feel an actual insert. I believe that that's probably PVC inside. Yeah, PVC inside there. Really nice two-tone there. Let's get to the uh, back. It's got that spongy material there. Hook and loop all over the place, so you can make that tighten it up wherever you want to. Got some really nice boots. Again, these are peg type. So basically there's a plastic mold inside and they glue the uh, foot insert in there. And this just has a peg, like standard peg that these will fit onto. But fantastic looking boots. I love the sole. They really did a great job on that. You can see the leather underneath, which is really, really cool. Really good, really good set of boots. So. Very cool, and again, you can use that on any type of figure that you wanted to. You do have the shirt. This is two-tone, brown under. I love this shirt, super, super cool. I would use this on, say, a division character, a set of jeans. Throw a shirt on there. It's got some built-in guards here. Hook and loop on the side for patches. And then we go to the plate carrier, and this is laser cut. This is in multicam. These vests are super, super cool, super easy to put on and off the figure. I'm just gonna show you how to do that right now. Take that, slide, just like that. Quick release, pops right off. Do get some foam inserts in here. Again, throw some change in there, but really nice plate carrier vest. Very, very cool, just like the real thing. Let's throw him over there. Do get a really nice backpack. It's got Molly all over the place. Really nice division bag. You can throw whatever you want on here, make it look super cool. Love the padded belt, but this is just like the uh, the real thing. I think it's probably probably a Kelty pack or something. Do you get some extra hands? Now this is really really cool. Let's pull this out and I'll hide that for a minute. We'll do that in a little bit. You get some extra regular hands and some feet, some feeties. So that's always nice for dressing up the figure a different way. I'm gonna come back to that other thing. All right, let's get in here. So much really good gear on this. I mean, really, this is a great figure. Great, great, great figure. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out. This right here is a multicam neck toque. And these are always good to dress up a figure because then you lose the neckline, the neck joint. So it covers up that. So if you're taking photos, really want to, want to dress something up and make it look really good, you don't like to see these joints. Okay, and then this right here is super, super cool. This is the brand new helmet, okay? This helmet is badass. They just keep getting better and better and better detail. But you can see it's got the arc rails here, and then it's got this whole shroud, and then it's got bungee on top. So just, just putting this together, besides the molds, putting all this stuff on here takes a long time. So to put these out in mass production, that's difficult. But really, really nice helmet, love the color. It's almost like an OD green, but very, very cool. Now this has a lot of different attachments on here. Let's see, where's all the helmet stuff? So first thing, the communication set. It's got earmuffs and these things right here slide right into that rail right there. And if you've seen my videos on my Patreon, 
You've seen me build helmets. They do take time, so you want to be careful when you're doing it. Uh, it comes with a lot of other helmet gear. So this is something super cool. Get some gun stuff, get a carabiner for the pack, then you get this little guy. Now, a lot of people don't know what this is, but this is actually a light. I think this is a mission first tactical light, NFT. And it gives you this little thing right here, okay? And this right here is got sticky on the back and you can stick that to whatever you want. And then this is just like a rail, like a Picatinny rail. And that little light slides right on there. So super cool. Again, you can throw it on the helmet if you want to. Uh, that's what it's supposed to do. So now you know, and knowing is half the battle. All right, it's got some other helmet stuff in here. Do you have a radio cord with push to talk on there? Nice radio. That's different than your standard US radios. I mean, they really do their, their research when they're putting this stuff together. And there is some other bells and whistles, but we'll, oh, the NVG kit. Let's see, and I think, Oh, there's something else, something important. What is it? Helmet Velcro. And this thing right here. This right here is a counterweight pouch. Got a hook and loop on it. Use this Velcro, stick some Velcro right there, some hook and loop, and then you throw this counterweight pouch on the back. And that is in multicam. So people are gonna want this really bad, but that helps you with the NVG, keeping the, the helmet centered weight distribution. So super, super cool. Great helmet kit. Once you put it on, it's fan freaking fantastic. They did a good job. All right, let's see what else we got. We got lots of pouches. So IFAC, this right here is pretty cool. This is a foldable pouch, like an admin pouch. It's just like the real thing. Close it up and multicam. This is OD. Do you get another all purpose pouch? So you get a multicam radio pouch. And you do get this right here. Now this goes with the main weapon and we'll get there in just a second. Really nice dump pouch. Again, molly on the side, throw some light sticks in there. Makes it look really, really good. Whenever you throw this onto a belt, I always throw a fishing weight in there or a couple, a couple of quarters and that'll make it hang really, really nice. So good pouch. You get a grenade pouch, you get some grenades again. Lots of stuff that you've gotten before, but it goes with the figure. These things right here are killer. So these are laser cut M4 mag pouches. And I love how high speed they are. So you can see there's no fraying on this right here, but this is laser cut. Really, really, really nice set of pouches that'll basically go right in here. So super, super cool. Plenty of stuff for the play carrier. Do you get a speed M4? mag fast mag holster that's for a magazine and you do get a really nice belt again easy and simple is really getting detailed as far as their belts go but this is laser cut on the side this is in multicam and you can really dress these things up so really nice belt you get a set of shears all right let's take a look at the holster i love 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 this holster this is super super cool it's got the locking mechanism on top right here that'll hold the pistol in place but it's a drop leg I love the single leg drop legs easy to put together but just a really really nice holster really really like this so they did a good job on that you get a really nice set of glasses these look like Oakley's and they have a like a gold tint to them which is really really nice let's just throw this on Good looking, really, really good looking. So, glasses always help to dress up a figure. You get some French patches, some O positive, A positive, and O negative. French pouch, patch, excuse me. And we get a couple of fast mag holsters for the pistol. Standard G pistol, this is pretty much what they carry. Moving parts, slide does move, magazine does come out. I love these drop plates on the back of the magazines. But very, very nice. Do you get some extra pistol magazines? Then you do get some grenades. These are 40 millimeter grenades. These are metal, I believe. Uh, maybe not. They're plastic. 
But that's right what this pouch right here is. So this holds three of those things. So three grenades. Now let's get to the, uh, the good stuff. Everything's good. This is good stuff. Tourniquet. Nice sling. It's a two point sling. Okay. I'm going to lay the uh, rifle out right here. So this is a hot rifle. Oh, this is the other thing. So this right here is a GoPro for the helmet and it's got some sticky tack on the back. Throw that up there like that. So lots of good helmet gear to really dress that up. But let's get to the, uh, the gun. Everybody likes the gun. And there's more helmet stuff. NVG mount. This right here, this is a little sensor, I believe. If you know what that is, leave that in the comments below. But that also goes with the helmet. Okay, so let's get to the rifle. Pull this guy out. Get the rifle and all sorts of accoutrements. Riser rail, PEQ, old school E-Attack. With laser markings, super, super cool. It's got a reticle, if you're able to get in there. It's got a reticle in the etched in. Okay. Hold, wait, hold. Mm. See it? Mm -hmm. Cool. So very good detail. And then we got that, which I'll show you in just a second. Okay. So the rifle is super cool because it's a SCAR 16. It's in this is a spray camouflage on top. It matches pretty much multicam or the French camouflage. So this comes with an EGLM grenade launcher. If you know what that stands for, again, EGLM. Leave that in the comments below. But this grenade launcher is super cool, super trick, and it comes on this shorty scar. And then you do get a really nice shorty buttstock. So meant to be really compact. But this grenade launcher is killer, 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 killer. Pop that open. So you can see it slides to the side, and then you can throw this round right in there. Close it up, bam, you're ready to rock and roll. And this right here is your trigger uh, for that. Magazine does come out, but super, super cool rifle. Love this thing, and I love the, uh, he did a black grip on there. So flip up front sight, okay, and that's where you get the rear sight right there. And that also flips, you throw that on the back. And then let's check this out. Be very careful with this, okay? A lot of people break these. So you can see how it opens. So always grab from the base. Don't grab here and pull. You're going to break it. But very, very cool rifle. Picatinny rail on top and on the sides. And then really nice suppressor. They did a good job. Again, fits on there. Everything's straight. Then you do get this thing right here. And this right here is your grenade sight, okay? And it'll go on this Picatinny rail right here. But you can see how detailed they get. There we go. It actually flips up. And then it flips like this. Super, super cool. But again, new part. You've seen this buttstock on another rifle, uh, but that's fantastic buttstock. I really like these, but fantastic looking rifle. So this is a real gem. Very, very cool. If you like this video and you want to see more exciting French figures, and you want to see me talk with a French accent, <laughs> drop a like, leave a comment, share this out to all of your friends and family members and stay tuned for more super cool content like this French dude. <laughs>